Hey, it's Carmen with a folk tale from India called The Jackals and the Lion. One day, two little jackals were strolling along minding their own business. When they came face to face with a huge lion, the lion said, Hello, I am king and you two are my lunch. Both jackals were terrified, but the smaller one was very clever. Sure, sure, no problem. We'll be your lunch, he said. But just so you know, there's another lion walking around here also calling himself king. What? roared the lion. Another lion? Where? They say he lives in there, said the jackal pointing to a well. Well, this made the lion angry. He looked into the well, saw his reflection in the water, and thought he was another lion. He roared and the other lion roared back. Roar! That was it. He lunged at the other lion, diving deep down into the water. By the time he came to the surface and figured out what had happened, the two little jackals had scampered happily away. The end. Where local news comes first. This is Nine Eyewitness News This Morning. Two people are dead after a triple shooting in Northeast Washington. We have a live report coming up. We have an exclusive interview with the Virginia family who encountered accused murderer Joseph. Hello, welcome back to Nine Eyewitness News This Morning at 632. And you're back on Nine. Pause to sunrise. It is up to 22 at 624 right now. It's clear skies, but it is cold. Got the coat. A cold start. And it is Talk about that. Sure, thank you. We'll be back after this. Where local news comes first. This is Nine Eyewitness News at noon. Good afternoon, Fox. Leading our news this afternoon, a double homicide in North. Where local news comes first. This is Nine Eyewitness News tonight. It is something that will be dealt with when the situation runs its course. New trouble tonight for Washington Wizards star basketball player Rod Strickland. Hello and thanks for joining us. I'm Bruce Johnson. The NBA season begins next week, but tonight we have to... We are going to the special live coverage of what's happening at the World Trade Center in... You're watching 9 Eyewitness News at 4 with Mike Buchanan, Beverly Burke, and Winter with Chief Meteorologist Doug Hill. 9 Eyewitness News, where local news comes first. You're watching 9 Eyewitness News at 5 with J.C. Hayward, Mike Buchanan, Weather with Chief Meteorologist Doug Hill, and Sports with Jess Atkinson. 9 Eyewitness News, where local news comes first. Eyewitness News at 6 with Gordon Peterson, Andrea Rome, Weather with Chief Meteorologist Doug Hill at Sports with Jess Atkinson. 9 Eyewitness News, where local news comes first. You're watching 9 Eyewitness News at 11 with Gordon Peterson, Andrea Rome, Weather with Chief Meteorologist Doug Hill at Sports with Jess Atkinson. Nine Eyewitness News, where local news comes first. Channel 6 News is everywhere. Live, the most watched news station in the Capital Region. This is Channel 6 News. Good evening, I'm Jerry Gretzinger. Mary Beth Wanger has the night off. If you haven't already... A Rotterdam neighborhood is on alert today for a convicted sex offender who police say has the propensity to strike again. That story is coming up.
And I'll tell you if rain will affect any of your outside plans over the weekend. Channel 6 News at 6 starts right now. Channel 6 News is everywhere. Live, the most watched news station in the Capital Region. This is Channel 6 News at 6. Good evening. A 19-year-old football player is killed after a two-car accident on... We'll go to Kuwait City. The news starts now. Channel 6 News is everywhere. Live, the most watched news station in the Capital Region. This is Channel 6 News at 11. Ooh. Tonight on Channel 6 News. A little change in your diet can mean a big change in your waistline. Canadian bacon instead of regular bacon is a great way to still have a meat. If you went down with six, you'll have a skinny and other low-fat alternative. Tonight, Channel 6 News at 5. Joe Pagliaruba, Channel 6 News at 6 and 11. You're on KVII-TV, Pro News 7. Coverage you can count on. Good evening, I'm Bridget Jacobs. You're on KVII-TV, Pro News 7, coverage you can count on. Four at 10. Don't miss Pro News 7, coverage you can count on. Good morning. Welcome back to News 6 Saturday morning. Your two six network with Cheryl Miller, Ray Collins, Stephanie Rochon, Chief Meteorologist Mike Goldberg's Guaranteed Forecast, and Lane Casadante with sports. News 6 at 6 continues. High rise crash on the Upper East Side. CBS 2 News was first on the scene, first in the air, first online. First with breaking news from the scene of the airplane crash. For continuing team coverage and every new development. is what some. You're watching KCRG TV 9. Now, from your 24 hour news source, this is KCRG TV 9 News at 10. You're watching KCRG TV 9. Now, from your 24-hour news source, this is the KCRG TV9 Morning News. You're watching KCRG TV9. Now, from your 24-hour news source, this is KCRG TV9 News at 5. At least 10 hours. News source, this is KCRG TV9 News at 10. This is Wink News Now, this morning. From Southwest Florida's news leader, this is Wink News Now at 10. Happened, Haley. Live from Southwest Florida's news leader, this is Wink News, this morning. Live from Southwest Florida's news leader, my Jim. this is Wink News at, his mic. at 5. This is all cute. Six. First tonight at 6, a live look at Sanibel, where the sun is peeking through the clouds. Actually, the sun's winning right here. Now on the Wink News Nightbeat. Bloodshed, Robert Cruz, rescue. And we had some rain. Live from Southwest Florida's news leader, this is Wink News at 10. First at 10 o'clock.